will stand against the Lord. No one can, and no one will. Who will stand against our King? No one can, no one will. my friends it's our friends we promise to keep on updating you about what we could be doing now this time round we're going to Bulu and a place in northern Uganda known as Park Nuoro that is the village that we're going to be reaching out to we're going to reach out to uh, more than 250 people throwing out 10 kilograms of uh, maize flour you know that uh, the COVID situation you know the pandemic that has affected so many especially with what to eat so we're updating you that today we are going to Bulu to give out food. Kindly pray for us as we spread love in the heart and world. Updates, as I promised to you, as we promised to you, right now we are at Chiliandongo district. We're proceeding to Gulu at Paknyoro village where we're going to meet more than 200 people. Yeah, we, we thank God because we made it here. You know, Chiliando is quite far as well from Kampala. And we, we plead for more prayers. We request you to stand with us, you know, um, in any way you can. That means, I mean, prayer, of course, prayer is the only thing, is the only way to go. So I encourage you, as you move with, with me, to go and we can be Good morning. It is a blissful morning indeed. Yes, this is Gulu Flamingo Motel where we slept off, I mean, for a night. And now we're going to um, Park Nyoro, uh, a near left village. But we're going to reach out. Yeah, basically, we're going to look at persons with disabilities, orphans, widows, and poverty stricken families. Thank you so much for your generosity. We thank you so much for your contributing heart because, I mean, you're going to feed someone, you're going to feed a family, you're going to give someone to, put, to, 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 to get something to put on. 
we need grateful and we are happy that um, you're working with us. I, I encourage you never to stop. I encourage you to keep moving with Quick for Christ Foundation. Yeah, I'm going to keep on updating you as the journey, as the day moves on. See you. Lord, I came to you a sinner. You took me from a pretty little thing with a naive heart to a perseverer. You speak to me through the dark. And at times when rain bursts through the clouds and no one surrounded me, no one around to see, as dark as dark can be. You were there, you saw, and you showed me the light. You opened my eyes. I was blind, but now even when I can't see, I still feel you by my side. You love me like your only child. And speak your word, I climb mountains and steeples Met many people, different personalities Different nationalities, different lives they led Before you came and saved them from their own personal tragedies And I've said amen one thousand times And it still ain't close enough to thank you for the things you brought to my life You give me happiness and pride With the mercy you provide You forgive me with no explanation as to why Sometimes I call on you, question it my name is Lamax Lambert Akena, Secretary of Health, Education and Community Services, Guru District. I am happy my brothers and sisters from Quick for Christ Foundation have brought us items, well packaged, for show some clothing and other things. We are happy that um, they connected with our person on the ground. And uh, this morning, Saturday, the items have been delivered. Please, as Gulu District, we are actually appreciative of uh, what Quick Foundation has done. And we urge you to always reach out to those who are actually needy. And uh, we wish you the best that the hand that gives receives more. Eh? Mm. I wish that every time you give, you receive more. Um, this part of the country has had a lot of problems. By the way, we had a bowler here. The rest of the other country had not had it before. So issues of uh, self-quarantine, isolation, and keeping social distances, we already knew them before. So during this COVID, we are just trying to remind ourselves. But also, the effects of this COVID, especially on those who are a bit incapacitated, it is great. I'm happy that you have chosen them and thank you so much. Why me? Ain't it funny how it works? You knew me right before the world began. Right before the world began. Maybe precious in his eyes. A perfect little image of his own. A perfect little image. Oh, that a man will look for me and think I'm something worth them searching for. Many times I walk the way, I hope I won't be running anymore. Why did you love? the subcommittee for this revision mobilization. We are really very grateful for the food that you've given us, for the clothes, for the shoes. I've seen nice sample thing. I wish I was that small. <laughs> I think I would be the beneficiary. However, that is not our mentality that when you bring good things, we take it for ourselves. Yeah, it's just yeah. fun. Yeah, you know. See, the portion that you've given to us, that one, the 30 bags that is going to the quarantine center and the treatment center. Thank you, ma'am. You know, you've really done a lot. Thank you. Blessings to the organization and to even the employees. Amen. We have no words that we can express to show our gratitude and the happiness. Even the mask alone cannot let someone know how happy I am. <laughs> I am because being in the shoes of somebody that you have to feed some people who are there, they are supposed to wait for food, is really difficult. Yeah. But I'm really very grateful 
for the food, for even those people that you're going to give to them at yeah. the, the uh, at at uh, the disability union, yeah. the wheel basketball team, on their behalf. I'm really very happy and I'm really thankful. Even to the community, they may not express it with their mouth, but yeah. I express because they have something to eat. Thank you. May God bless you. Bless you, ma'am. Thank you so Amen. much. All right. Yeah. Opango, you say Kope. That's how they greet in Acholi. So I'm I'm at Gulu District offices. Now this this is where we've served 30 bags of um, lace flour to the quarantine center and even those that are not able to get what to eat around the district. Now the journey is still going on. The journey is still going on and we are going to Park Nyoro, that is the village where we're going to meet so many elderly widows and orphans plus persons with disabilities. Now from here we're going to a wheel basket bow arm is it called wheel basket something team. Eh? These are people with disabilities, both mental and physical. We're also going to serve what you've given to us. Your 10,000 has worked. Your one dollar has worked. Your one pound has made a difference. I mean, someone is going to enjoy food for the whole month. Thank you so much. I love you. Thank you for contributing anything that you've been able to contribute. I mean, thank you. Let me see you later. I got information about uh, your imminent coming a few weeks ago that uh, a kind group from Kampala was coming down here to pay charitable to my team of which are basketball. We do disability sports and uh, we are very popular team in the best in the county. Right? Really? We are the defending champion. And, uh, <laughs>
This is what we call Manyata House in African language, basically in Acholi. Yes, we are at Gulu um, at a certain village known as Pakinyoro, where we are going to serve around more than 100 people. Yeah, basically widows, um, persons with disabilities and orphans. You know, we give to these mothers because they have so many to feed and they have, I mean, a lot of responsibilities. So. I encourage you to keep on contributing, to keep on supporting, to keep on standing with the Creek for Christ Foundation as we spread love in the hurting world. I will completely let you know as I mean we, we go about the journey, more and more is yet to come. Please enjoy the ride. Franco, one come Ma bongi, ki ma okwon. Anta ma anapoi ma ter de de. Wan wati kany pa ni kwat ma be, mu kwe, ki ma ma raj pe. Anapu uru twal. Ka udok, u yoka ka jur kwe yu, u ba ma polo, u guku, u mede ki tij ma ma be, u ba guku ya te tira. Pe no dul, ma kiru kany, ki pa ni kwat kany, pe gi na yor. Si we ta ma tut. Menane,
My name is Ingle Emmanuel, the director of Creek for Christ Foundation. You could be asking yourself, what is Creek for Christ Foundation? This is a foundation that is reaching out to persons with disabilities, basically children, widows, and poverty-stricken families. Today we've been at Gulu, at a certain village known as Pak Nyoro, where we've served more than a hundred people. We went to a disability center as well, we served more than a hundred people. We went to the um, district tax force where we served more than 70. So basically today we've reached out more than 370 people. Yes, um, we're here basically not to do politics, not to do what, but we are Christians and we do believe in God. So we've been serving this, that's, that's why you can see um, the happiness in the background, you can hear the chanting. Because people have received what to eat, being that the pandemic has affected so many of them. We've come up as an organization to reach out to them. Yeah, so I'm happy that you've donated something that they have received today. Please, my sister, my brother, my dad, my uncle, your money has gone somewhere you've just seen. People have received what to eat, people have gotten clothing, people have gotten shoes. And we humbly request you to continue having that generosity towards Creek for Christ Foundation. Now, if you want to know us, we're located at Musega, Kampala. You can check us on our YouTube channel. You can check us on Twitter handle. You can check us on uh, Twitter handle is at For Creek. You can check us on Facebook, Creek for Christ Foundation. You can as well go on WhatsApp us. Our numbers are there. Thank you so much. May God bless you. You love me too. Thank you for loving me.